this video, we're going to be checking out Captain Chords 2 by Mixed in Key. Captain Chords is a powerful tool to aid in the creation of memorable chords and melodic hooks. Recently upgraded to version 2, in this video we'll be focusing on some of the new features such as the timing patterns and new strum control. So Captain Chords loads as both a MIDI effect plugin and a software instrument. I've got a version of the software instrument loaded on a channel here. I've created some simple chords in A minor. And let's take a look at the timing patterns. So this is new to version 2 and you can use the timing patterns to alter the layout of where the chords will change. So if we scroll through some of the presets here. And we get loads of different presets here and some of the icon should give some indication as to how they rearrange the chords but let's add a few extra chords into our progression here we can add extra chords using the plus button and then change the chord in the section above And now we can scan through some of the different timing presets to audition different transitions between the chords. There's plenty of timing presets to choose from, catering for both sparse and busier progressions. And we can create much more complex sequences really efficiently. We also have some options up here for changing the overall feel. So I've got it set to normal at the moment. If we switch it to fast, it halves the amount of time that the chords play over. So this is excellent for creating half and double time fills with your MIDI or just creating half or double time sections. So if I switch from the fast changes now, to slow changes, and the sequence now becoming much more spread out. Another new feature of Captain Chords 2 is the strum. And if you watch, for example, the first chord in our sequence here as I increase the strum, it adds subtle timing variations between notes in the chord. We can also alter the nature of the strum in the second box setting the notes to strum upwards or downwards. And we also get a swing control now to add a little bit of groove to our programming, which would be quite useful for fast changes or a faster rhythm. And here we can set either an 8th note or 16th note swing. So now let's check out how we can use the MIDI effects plugin that comes with Captain Chords. I have an instance of Serum loaded here. Nice little pad sound loaded up and I've loaded Captain Chords as a MIDI effects plugin. And I've got some chords written in here to trigger my instance of Serum. I've also got a bass sound loaded in Serum on another channel. And this time I've gone and loaded up the Captain Deep MIDI effects plugin. So now we can connect this one simply pressing the connect button 
and it connects it to our Captain Chords and creates a bass sound to follow. It'll always be in key, we can change some stuff around. And we also get uh, Captain Melody, so the same same workflow. We load Captain Melody, we load a synth sound. I've got a nice lead sound loaded here. And then we connect this one in the same way. Any changes we make to Captain Chords, the other two Captain plugins will follow suit. So I can change this first chord or the second chord and the others follow. You can undo and redo. It's all non-destructive with the editing. And one of the other new features to Captain Chords 2 is some of the keyboard shortcuts. So we can write chords into our progressions directly from our MIDI keyboard. We get our instance of chords back up. By pressing notes on our MIDI keyboard or chords on our keyboard, we write them into our progression, which is really cool. And we can use the right and left arrows to scroll between chords so very quickly and efficiently stop playback audition a different chord go to the next chord the next chord it's a great way to audition different chords and set up in this way, the Captain Deep and Captain Melody will create patterns that are rhythmically and musically in keeping with the progression created in chords. Once we're happy with what we've created in any one of the three plugins, we can simply drag and drop the MIDI into our DAW for further editing and arranging. So be sure to check out Captain Chords 2 by Mixed In Key which is available now at ADSRSounds.com.